It is a great pleasure that I welcome you to the Interior Design Graduating Class of 2021. The students are very committed and dedicated to the chosen design disciplines. Now, I would like to introduce you to Tom Skeen, who the students have asked to host this evening's events. Hello everyone, welcome tonight to our live stream format of the graduating class for Interior Design for CIT. We're downstairs in Thor's Hammer. I'm going to take you upstairs right now and we're going to introduce you to the class. Come with me. So um, everyone watching at home, you may be at work, you might be driving and pulling over to watch this. Um, thank you so much for tuning in. This is the graduating class for 2020. Tonight's really about the celebration of their work. So shall we get started? Yes. got three students' awards that we have from industry and then some of the students have actually would like to, uh, awards to be presented that they've made for themselves, which is great. Uh, it's been lovely to watch the students connect to each other. They've supported each other through this and it has been a hard time, so well done to all of you. Uh, Tom, I'm going to actually announce the awards and then I'm going to ask you to shake oh, the official hands. Oh, okay. Very official. Oh, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> okay. The first award is the Ergonomics Award. Now this is actually given to a student who has actually applied the principles to not only their projects but also part of ergonomics is actually being kind to ourselves. Pacing themselves, getting things on time, all of those type of things. And the person that we have awarded that to is Erin. So <laughs> Okay, the next award is the KBDI Award. They are specialists in kitchen and bathrooms and it's an industry award. And it's actually for someone who's striving to achieve and is very consistent in the two years. And that's going to Azura. <laughs> The last award is actually more from the teachers and the staff at CIT and this student we felt it's really hard because we wanted to give awards to everybody, you all deserve them, but there was one student who really struggled in the first year and has actually produced incredible work towards the end. So we're calling it an achievement award and yes it goes to Tom. <laughs> Students have actually created some of their own awards. Hey. And we also have two awards for the teachers. Uh, the Teacher of the Year goes to Duncan. <laughs> 